North Carolina, the percentage of African-American students who are suspended is significantly higher than the percentage enrolled. A study released by researchers at the University of Pennsylvania shows statistics from each county in our state. WNCT's Zora Stevenson has details on the study's results specifically in the east. Angela, the study shows African Americans make up 51% of suspensions in North Carolina schools, but are only 26% of the population. Educators and parents I spoke to say there's no one reason behind the statistic. It doesn't say why. It doesn't say what the root causes of those infractions are. A study released by researchers at the University of Pennsylvania reveals disproportionate rates when it comes to the number of African American students suspended in North Carolina. In the East, African Americans make up more than 71% of suspensions in Lenore County, but are 44% of the population. In Pitt County, African Americans are 75% of suspensions, but only 43% of the population. Onslow and Craven County also had disproportionate numbers. Pitt County parent Regia Coggleton Rachmad believes there's racial profiling in our country. I don't think we're immune to it. I don't think it's, it's, it's something that happens in the community. You see um, African Americans gather, you, um, you, someone might have gotten in trouble with something previously. Coggleton says racial profiling could be a variable behind the statistics, but there are many factors. I think I feel as though students who have less resources have more idle time. That can be a situation. Um, I don't think that some students know the um, the consequences of what happens when they do get suspended. North Lenore High School principal Gil Respis says there are guidelines for each type of suspension. There is a matrix kind of that we go by with the first offense, second offense, and third offense, and we really stick to that. Patrick Holmes with Lenore County Public Schools says studies like this make people think. I don't know that there, there is an inherent value in the numbers themselves, but there is an inherent value in being reminded to be fair in dealing with students. Researchers conducted the study to raise consciousness about bias and racial inequities in school discipline. Zora Stevenson, not on your side.